have interested people since the earliest times. Kaya naman we can find traces of them through oral, written, and graphic literature. Kaya naman here are some FYIs on elves through history. At alam nyo ba na ang unang record ng elves ay galing sa Norse mythology? Alfar ang tawag sa kanila nila Thor and friends. Here's a cool fact. The Norsemen believe that after death, pwede maging elf ang isang human as exemplified by a number of characters sa kanila mga stories. Eto, medyo malilito kayo. Medieval people had a notion that elves and dwarves are just one. Eh kasi naman halos parehas ang depiction nila dati. Also, many dwarven characters have elven names and vice versa. Fast forward, elves began to take a new form. Na-associate naman sila ngayon sa mga fairies. This is embodied by fairy tale icons such as Puck, Hobgoblins, and Brownies culminating to the annual year-end idols, the Christmas Elf. Pero pagdating ng 20th century at ni J.R.R. Tolkien, nabasag ang notion na to. Current elven fans depict them in their beautiful human-like form, armed with a sagacious mind and precise bow. Tulad nitong husband ko na si Legolas. And from books, elves also transcended sa mga games, from paper and pen, to hardcore, to real-time strategy. Kaya naman we now have Dungeons and Dragons, Elder Scrolls, Warhammer, and syempre ang hit na hit at walang katulad na World of Warcraft. Still I am hunted.